Hi everybody, this is Roxy. And I have a small haul from Wally World. Um, I just picked up some things to make some charms for all of the tins that I'm making. So I found a pack of, I've got gold, I just needed some silver jump rings and lobster clasps. I found these in the clearance aisle. Super cute. So I thought I'd make some little girl I mean, I'm planning on it, so I thought those would be cute for those. And I found these beads. These were $3.50. I love the ice cream cone shape. And what I think I might do is scan this in to my computer. This is hopefully it'll work. and Or else I can just trace this on a piece of paper and scan it in. And then make... Uh, cutting file out of it so I could make uh, little booklets where a little ice cream cone booklet would have fit right in there and I'm going to try the same thing with this but I mostly got the beads to use for little charms for the um, all the different minis and books and traveler's notebooks that I'm making so that is my Wally World haul and I also headed over to Dollar Tree I've been wanting to make <clears throat> these um, like little kind of Christmas ornaments using these blocks and I will probably do that in a couple of months. Maybe I'll try them now and see how it works, but I'm not sure I'm going to do it yet. So, but I got the blocks finally because they never had them. They'd always be out, um, so I found some. Bought another one of these little totes. Um, they do not fit an 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper, but they're, I think they're like 9 by 11 or something like, or 7 and 3 quarters. Well, I suppose, suppose I could measure. <clears throat> they're just under it. Yeah, so they're like 7, not quite 7 and a half, like 7 and a quarter by... Ten and a quarter, but I I wanted for like projects instead of having all this stuff all over my desk, I can keep it in here. So here's what I got at Dollar Tree. I found a bunch of these for um, specifically. I'd like to kind of get all these little letters out, and I noticed about three quarters of it are the beads. But still, I'm gonna sort them all out. I try to alphabetize like, <clears throat> I usually go A through F, G through L, M, C through P, Q through Z. So I'm going to try to do that with these and sort out the letters so I can, you know, find them quickly. So I got three of those. I bought this. I've got a package going out to a friend um, that is overdue. And so I found that for her. So I bought one for myself and I thought she'd probably like it too. Then I found these for little girl albums. I love this. It's really cute. And you know what you could do with these, um, what I'm thinking, is cover them with um, liquid adhesive like the glossy accents. And you'd have a higher quality uh, sticker. So we'll see how that works. I'll probably start with one of the smaller ones. And I found these, I thought these would be cute for my recipe albums, super cute. And I found this, I wanna put um, some of my uh, gouache in here. I really should have gotten two of them, but I only got one. So that when I wanna use it, I can just, cause I have them in tubes, I'd like to get them in a pallet so that I'm not wasting all the paint. So that's my haul, and thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you can. And um, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.